The district recently released a statement in support of LGBTQ staff and students based on some of the comments and the recent disruption at the Library Pride Storytime event. This is long overdue. Years ago, we received valuable information through a $10 million Safe Schools grant that outlined ways to improve structural design and the inner workings of our schools with regard to SEL and pre prevention. The great grant data has now been misplaced. Similar to the mysterious disappearance of years worth of ignored sexual assault complaints, how does New Hanover County Schools continuously and conveniently lose documentation? The Title IX survey provided more safety data reflecting the dire straits of our LGBTQ plus students and sexual assault victims. The county denies that their negligence put families at risk at a public library event. While the school board puts victims of sexual assault through traumatic psychological evaluations in an attempt to exhaust them and cover up crimes. After over four years, the civil suit against New Hanover County Schools will likely be pushed back further. While we wait for excuses and deflection, lives are at risk. Suicide has taken lives with regard to both sexual assault and LGBTQ harassment. If the public wants to be outraged, channel your anger into supporting victims of sexual assault and refrain from confusing the situation with blatant lies. If this board truly wants to do what's right for children, acknowledge the past transgressions and put an end to the gross tactics of your litigation team and torturing brave survivors of school predators. Implement policy to empower and protect all students. Use your seat at the table to do good work or risk losing it to someone far more dangerous. How ironic that a year ago, the superintendent and former board chair filed charges against myself and another advocate for simply seeking accountability and safety as we do today. You fear involved community activists, but those that attack young children for reading a story about same-sex parents and those who protect pedophiles don't seem to scare you at all. Thank Got you, Ms. Caney.